Good afternoon. Thank you for the opportunity to present you with my vision of your backyard. The theme of the program is connecting the outside to the inside, focusing on three general areas. Dining, entertaining, and relaxing. Formal spaces are placed closer to the home and less formal spaces further removed. Near the home, with its brick facade and clean lines, we will place the entertaining spaces. To the left of the doors and level with the sill will be the outdoor kitchen and dining area. This area will be created by using the fill generated from the excavation of the swim pond, which we'll cover in a few minutes. Paving stones move to the left and right and emphasize the wide space ahead. Shade on this side will be provided by a pergola over the dining table along with lattice and vining plants next to the outdoor kitchen. This lattice structure will do double duty to create privacy for diners. Seating for five at the bar on the outdoor kitchen will provide one of several socialization spots. In addition to the, uh, to the seating, the outdoor kitchen will have a grill, a sink, and a refrigerator, as well as lighting for the grill, under bar lighting, and lights over the dining table which will seat eight to 10 people. The, the outdoor kitchen countertop will ideally come from remnants for uh, cost savings, but also for environmental purposes. Couch and chairs under the second pergola will create a conversation area which are just which is just a step or two down from the main level pavers in this area move the eye toward the cabana and the pool inside of the fenced swim area, the cabana with a small porch will provide space for the family to change an outdoor solar shower and storage for swimming related items. Access to the pool will be provided by a self-closing gate near the cabana. Inside of the cabana, there is space set aside for storage and a privacy curtain. The boxes along the, the back wall will open provide, and provide seating. A curtain divides the space and can be opened and closed. And then additional storage in the corner of the bottom right, bottom left of the cabana. Lawnmower access to the mown path will be through a set of locking gates behind the cabana. No allowance for diving is possible, but the pond will have areas deep enough for the family to be fully immersed. Pavers transition to grass to connect the formal and informal areas of the landscape. The waterfall and stream provide oxygenation to the swim pond water, as well as a soundscape of calm for the hammock nook under the trees. Dappled sun from the birch trees and the rhythm of the waving grass enhances the experience of calm and relaxation in this space. While the idea was to have the hammocks 
hang from the trees. That is not likely to be possible for quite some time. And so two or three four by four, four inch by four inch posts will be installed with hardware to create the hammock nook. From year to year, the path of the mown grass moving from one space from the from the bridge uh, to the access path up to the woodlot will change, emphasizing the temporary nature of the landscape and the garden. Thank you for your time. And if you have any questions about the design, please feel free to ask.